How do you recognize potentially disruptive innovations? Not all innovations are disruptive. Many aren't. But some will be. So what do you do? Because as a future manager, you don't want to be caught off guard by something coming up and eating away most of your customers as you pursue increasingly high margins and, and profitability with your existing products. So what do you do? Two suggestions. Number one, talk to those on the experimental edge. And number two, rotate and interact across traditional organizational boundaries. Talk about the experimental edge. So you need to keep up to date with what's going on in your field with your service. You need to be able to identify what researchers and venture capitalists are most focused on the products and services your company delivers. Okay. By keeping up to date, now this could be uh, conversations like over dinner, this could involve reading and keeping up to date with research and business uh, news related to these technologies. It could be a variety of things, but you need to expose yourself and stay up to date on what's going on at the experimental edge. What new things are people trying? What new products? What new businesses? What new startups are coming out? And see how those might, think about how those might one day be able to compete against what you're currently offering. Number two, not only expose yourself to new ideas outside of your organization, but also in. Many of the top technology firms uh, rotate their staff on a regular basis. This helps both with accounting controls as well as it helps uh, put uh, people on new projects or interact across uh, departments so that they can uh, get more ideas, get more cross-fertilization, we call it, of ideas and interaction to help see what's going on and what other people in the organization are seeing, and not just you focused on your product or your function in the, in the organization and driving the profitability and the bottom line for that specific product. Okay, so the underlying thing is keep an eye on the horizon, talk to a lot of people, interact with people who aren't necessarily directly involved in what you're doing from day to day. And that should help you keep an eye on the market, keep an eye on the industry, so that you can watch for potentially disruptive innovations.